Good afternoon everyone, good afternoon. Another lovely day in Kusamui. It is roughly 4 p.m. guys. And one thing that I gotta say guys, I need to go to Bangkok very soon. Because if you look at my face, you know what I'm dealing with. And I have really really tough time with my eye I'm following everything that doctor says I'm using the air drop air sorry eye drops every eight hours washing my face washing my hand more than hundred times a day washing my eye with the eye wash but it's not working guys it is not working and I'm sick and tired of going to doctor here and using different medication so I'm not gonna do it anymore I don't want to go to Bangkok I don't have nothing to do in Bangkok and if you following me for a while you know I don't like big cities but I don't have a choice because Kusamui I really love this island. This is the island that helped me with my anxiety and so many other problems. I would say for rough, roughly for past three years. But even when I'm talking to the local people about doctor, how expensive and unknowledgeable they are, Everybody says yes. Even the local people say, yeah, we are agree. That's the situation here. So I have a one thing that I gotta tell you if you wanna come to Kusamui. It is a beautiful island. Make sure have your uh, good travel insurance. Without travel insurance, don't even think about it guys don't even think about it because based on my experience this is the most expensive doctor that everybody says exists in Thailand like in the hospital for just a visit is 3,000 baht guys it is crazy so make sure if you come in to visit this beautiful island make sure have a really 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 good travel insurance so in case if something happen regardless if you are here for one day or two days or one week or ten days because i'm sure you're going to rent a bike i'm sure you're going to eat street food and a lot of people getting sick because of the street food and a lot of people having an accident here with the bike or maybe you're gonna pick up some sort of diseases like the way I got. So make sure don't take any chances and make sure get your travel insurance. This is my advice because here is expensive guys. It's just I don't know. It just I spent so much money so far for something that I'm dealing with for past 11 days and still you guys looking at my eye just take a look at it it's just it's just getting better but it's just taking a long time and I don't think this is like supposed to take this much time 11 days but anyways guys I'm, I'm gonna go to Bangkok because I have no other choice so I'm going to Bangkok next few days. Uh, not because I want to go to Bangkok. There's nothing in Bangkok. I've been to Bangkok maybe 10 times. But I got to go and fix my eye. I don't have no other choice. Anyway, this is my recommendation to you guys. If you come into this lovely island. There's two things that you need to watch. One, cost of doctor and everything. Also, make sure you have a proper... Uh, travel insurance and number two obviously you know is a taxi prices so this is the two things that is just like based on my experience so many times that I'm here so 
Now, I was sitting in my room again, and same thing. You know, watching news and all this crazy stuff that happening. So, I'm sure you know what's happened to Donald Trump, guilty of 34 <laughs> counts, all of them. <laughs> so, it's just like a comedy show. I was watching the news in regarding Donald Trump, but I got sick of it. I thought to myself, I'm gonna go for a walk. I don't care. I did everything that doctor told me. I didn't pressure myself, I didn't swim. But it's not working, folks, it's not working. What I'm gonna do? I'm gonna just sit and sorry about my eye. Probably it's gonna rain, but I have an umbrella. But let's see, where are we gonna end up? No, my friend, no, no, no taxi. Thank you very much. And other things, guys. This is based on online information that I got. So, Kusamui had grab. Still, there is a grab here, and I drive. In drive, sorry, in drive or I drive. There is an app that is the cheapest one for online transport. They asked me for three thousand baht. You're crazy. The yeah, yeah. hospital is crazy expensive. Or so, like I make money or you make money. You're making money, but they're not fixing me. You understand? Like yeah. if they. Better see in love. Yeah, better go to Bangkok. Everybody telling me. Everybody. Yeah, better. Everybody telling me don't don't spend your money here. Go to yeah, Bangkok. Yes, yes. Because here they're not gonna do anything. Much better. Yeah. So I got sick of it. So I'm sitting in my room. I said to go to myself to go a little bit walk and you know. But you just you see. Wow, more Yeah. I just see red. And this one too. I think you part F fast, you go. Yeah, next three days I'm going. I don't have no choice. I don't want to go to Bangkok because I don't really like Bangkok. But I don't have no other choice. But the, the doctor is everything. Everything, yeah. I heard there's a lot of good doctors there. So. <laughs> I'm gonna go to okay, beach and then come here for dinner. Take care. Okay, thank you. I'll see you soon. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Thank you so much. Yeah. <laughs> bye bye, see you soon. So this is my favorite restaurant in Lamai Beach. I'm sure you guys know that. I'm sure you guys saw it on my previous video. So even she knows my situation. Yes! Guys, look at this piece of land. It's beautiful for sale by owner. Wow! This is a perfect location for a hotel, man. Really lovely. Actually, you don't have an access to the beach, or maybe you do from the back, but you are on the main road. Or, I believe there's one thing is missing in, in Lamai, shopping mall. Maybe a small shopping mall is good there. You know, not too big, but you know. I guess small shopping mall works there perfectly. Guys, there's a lovely beach here. It's just between Shuang and Lamai. This is like the beginning of Lamai. I want to show you guys. I've been there a few times and called Silver Beach, I believe. And I really loved it. It is a small, private, and it's beautiful. And this is an Airbnb, I guess. a house for it. sorry and there's another Airbnb kind of things I never stayed there but looks really nice I guess it's a silver beach if I'm not wrong
Yeah, it is a silver beach, guys. Uh, I'm, I'm right. So silver beach is very famous. I'll take you guys now. Somebody come. This way goes to the silver beach. Am I correct? Beach, beach, swimming, beach. It's okay, it's okay, no problem. So there is few resort here, guys. I was planning to stay in this resort right here in this bungalow a few months ago, but the review it wasn't really good. The review it wasn't so good. Hello. So there is another resort here called Crystal Bay. And sometimes when I'm going to Crystal Lamai and when I tell taxi, you know, I'm going to Crystal Lamai, they think Crystal Bay. So this is more famous, I guess. So. so it is really peaceful location. Really lovely. I'll show you guys. So it's a walking distance to Lamai Central. So again, depends on your walking habits. You know, some people they don't want to walk more than two minutes. But for me, it's just like nothing piece of cake so if you come to silver beach i'm gonna take you guys there's a famous restaurant there that a lot of people you know daytime go in there it's just like a beach club small beach club it is not too big it is not like new but it is very crowded and busy and the silver beach is very nice too guys i'll show you guys now all these clothing stores still here. Last time when I was here, this summertime was here. And it's still here. Very unique stuff. So there's a lot of bike here. People coming and parking their bike here. And walking through the beach. And this is a Bay Crystal Beach, I guess. So this is the resort. And you see most of them is empty. And there's a restaurant here. And this is a Silver Beach. Ah, man, there's nobody here. That's so funny. Holy macaroni, guys. Last time when I was here, here it was packed. But look now, there's nobody here. Nobody come. Nobody here. They call this Silver Beach, guys. Silver Beach. So it is a low season. What, what do you expect? I'm sure there's a lot of people, including me, enjoying this. There are not so many people here. A lie. So you can stay in this resort and have access to the Silver Beach. And it's kind of private, small. But obviously when it's high season, there's a lot of people here. But now it's just like everywhere else. Nobody. Nobody. But you can see few people. Oh. Few people with proper eyes, not like me. One eye is almost closing and the other one is affected too. Hello, somebody cup. Yeah, this is my situation guys. I have one eye. One eye and 
half an eye. So basically, all together, I have half an eye. <laughs> See, there's a lot of resorts here, guys. So if you decided to stay here, this is like between Lamai, in the beginning of Lamai. So next to the road, very easy to travel here. So obviously you can jump on your bike and go to the Shuang or this way, Lamai or anywhere. So that's the way it is. There is a massage place up there guys, that's, could be the view is fantastic up there, let's see. right there so it is a fantastic place to get the massage up there and there's a restaurant next to it no I actually upstairs upstairs is a restaurant and and the next floor is a massage place and the view is fantastic you get some massage And there's another resort here, but overall it's very quiet. Look at me guys, I think I'm crazy. With one eye, I'm planning to do some sort of crazy stuff, which is really I can't, I guess, it's just like, I cannot touch anything, I don't want to touch my eye, but definitely once I have a, you know, when my eye heals, I want to go up there and take picture, see, and then show you guys the beautiful silver beach, probably view from up there is much, much better, but now I cannot do it. Even those rooms upstairs, they have a beautiful view. Yeah, Silver Beach is very famous, guys, but it's very quiet and peaceful now. But usually when it's high season, here is full, guys, full. I like that restaurant view up there, guys. Lovely.
There's something going on in the end, guys. Let's see. I guess somebody getting married. Taking pictures. Yeah. Look at it. Let's see. Hey, somebody come. <laughs> Why am I saying the guy to the guy somebody come? I got mixed up. I was trying to say hello. <laughs> And I'm not, I don't feel good guys, really, like I hope you guys understand that, I don't feel good, I don't feel good, I'm just pushing myself. Ah. There's a restaurant here. Oh yeah, these people getting married. <laughs> nice. Yeah, somebody getting married here, taking pictures. There's some noise coming up from there. Let's see what is going on. Silver Beach in a low season. Somebody help. Somebody help. What happening up there? <laughs> Somebody singing. I guess it's really religious ceremony. Oh. Oh. What's going on here? Bunch of local people just that's a concert. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> A bunch of local people just enjoy their time and singing. That's really cool. <laughs> Guys, they have everything. They have a speaker, they have a microphone. <laughs> That's lovely. Chilling by the water, you know? <laughs> Oh, now they have a ice and drink. Probably they're gonna just chill all day. That's lovely, man. That's lovely. Imagine that. This is, doesn't cost anything to anybody. And they have these options here. For example, in Canada, like we didn't have, when I was going to school, you know, we didn't have this kind of option. You know, we didn't, we didn't have money. And we didn't have no option to entertain ourselves because it's just like 10 months of winter. What are you gonna do? 
what are you going to do, you know? And anywhere you go, you have to, you know, pay. Yeah, there's no pay, you know? What are you going to pay? Just come, be group of your friends, just chill, basic, you know? No drama, no nonsense. Oh, there's somebody walking up there with their luggage. Oh, there's a bungalow up there. Somebody, ha. Yeah, there's a bungalow up there, guys. This guy's just arrived. Somebody help, somebody my. Ah, somebody getting married. Somebody getting married. Somebody in trouble. No, I'm just joking. I wish them all the best. Full of joy, happiness, peace. So this is a silver beach guys I really recommend here if you don't want to be but the only thing is like around here there's not much supermarket yeah there is a 7-eleven guys there's a 7-eleven like if you want to stay here there's just a few minutes to Lamai a few minutes to Shuang Shuang is right there you see Shuang is right there guys I used to walk probably a walk between Lamai to Shuang maybe hundred times guys hundred times it's nothing like Okay, I'm not saying you, you, you should walk, but it is close, guys. So you have an option to go to Shuang, you have an option to go to Lamai, and anywhere else. You know, so this is Silver Beach. A lot of options, a lot of resorts. And if you're planning to stay here, this is a lovely place. Lovely. You should come and enjoy Silver Beach. I have to keep cleaning my eye, guys. If the water is, I don't know what happened to me, man. I have no idea. I never ever had recovery of 11 days on anything, man. This is like 11 days of nonsense. I get up in the morning, it's the same thing. I go to bed, same thing. I take all this medication and wash with eye wash maybe 100 times a day. Ah, man. Ah, so. Let's go to Bangkok and let's see what's gonna happen in Bangkok. Let's see if somebody is going to fix me up in Bangkok. And another things that I gotta say to you guys, I have somebody that sending me keep nasty messages and the reason so guys it's going to rain very soon pretty much we're going to end up this video from a lovely silver beach in lamai kusamui Yeah, it's going to rain and it's going to rain very heavy like last night man guys like it was raining last night so heavy
So you know what guys, tomorrow we're gonna have a dinner in that restaurant up there. I wanna really go there and see it. Hello, Sabrika. So the view is good and hopefully tomorrow doesn't rain. So definitely I'm gonna come back here and have a dinner in that restaurant. Ah, this resort is very nice. So nice. I don't like it because they don't have some sort of privacy bullshit now. I'm just going wrong way guys. I'm going wrong way. I have to go this way. Yeah. It is safe for Beyonce City there's no wall so pretty much anybody from the beach can go. But that's the way it is. Usually all the resort is like that. You know there's but it seems to me at this at the night they have a security so usually it's like that. This is all ladies clothing, but it's so nice guys. Look at it. So ladies, if you're coming to Silver Beach, Samui, come and shop here. It is so nice. I really love it. Everything is like handmade. And last time when I was here, it was here called Summertime. Oh man, I was hoping my eye to get better soon and stay here for next like two weeks. Because I don't have nothing to do in Bangkok. What I'm gonna do in Bangkok? Seriously, nothing. But for my eye, I have to go. I don't have no choice. I have no choice. I cannot go to the hospital and pay 3,000 baht again. I can't. This is like crazy and they don't do nothing. It seems to me everybody knows that, even the restaurant owner. This lady says, no, go, 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 here is not good. Oh, man. To me, personally, I like low season everywhere. Because when there's too much tourist here, I don't like it. Regardless, anywhere. Anywhere. So when it's last tourist, I really love it. I really love it. So this is the time that I want to be here. Well, unfortunately, uh, I don't know. I hope, pray for me. I hope I feel better next two, three days. So I don't need to go to Bangkok because now is the loveliest time in Kusamu. No traffic, no tourists, no gas. You know, my hotel 80% is empty. So you can go swim by yourself. Last time when I was here, swimming pool was full. But now, nobody, nobody in the swimming pool. So, that's what I like. That's what I like. But unfortunately, my eye. My eye. You see guys, that's a silver beach right there. And there's a restaurant right there. A lot of people go in there. And few resort here few bay crystal and there's few other one crystal bay there's a yacht club here so. somebody go oh this is a situation guys this is the situation. Yeah, guys, I really love it when it's quiet. Maybe it's not for everybody. Hello, somebody come. Maybe it's not for everybody. A lot of people traveling when it's high season. But no, no, I like low season. To me, it's the perfect time. Perfect time. Perfect time. And it's going to rain, guys. Last night, it was raining crazy twice. And I couldn't sleep because first time I had to wait until 12 o'clock for my medication. And after that, I couldn't sleep. So, I guess it took me two, three hours. I was keep watching news and 
all this stuff funniest stuff comedy so US news is like stand-up comedy really a stand-up comedy guys it's just like the guy has 34 count of he's not ending up in jail probably he's not gonna go to jail I don't know he's, he's going to be a president I, I guess I don't know yeah he was guilty of all counts all 34 <laughs> well that's a big big piece of land man if I had money I was building a small shopping mall here Lamai needs a small shopping mall the one like in Shuang you know that's a perfect spot and guess what if shopping mall comes here Lamai can be even more busy so there is another land here for sale so one day you know whoever owned all this land they're going to make really good money very soon next few years because obviously here is getting busy day by day but if you are somebody with a lot of money and if you want to build a shopping mall so that was my idea I need one percent See, just give me one percent. One percent. Give me one percent commission. So that's good enough for at least one year of traveling. You know? Somebody cup, somebody cup. So this is the English language. So here that we can get extension visa, guys. In case if you want to learn English or Thai, and stay here, it's just the paperwork, guys. They're going to charge you, and then they're going to send you home. Go learn Thai language online. But you can stay. This is the phone. There is another Muay Thai. Summon Muay Thai. A lot of people now. Now is the best weather for exercise. It is not too hot. And you see those villas back there, guys? All those villas are in Airbnb. And the price and comes with the kitchen so it is very nice one time I was booking uh, it is nice and the review is nice right there so you see that guys you have your own balcony you have on your own room and you have your own kitchen and again it is very convenient next to the main road there is one or two 7-eleven around here so it is good The building villas everywhere. Wow, this is a nice design. Wow, look at this open concept. I really love this. Like you have a kitchen, living room downstairs, and that's probably that's your balcony. You walk upstairs like a loft style. You have one bedroom upstairs. That's good enough. That's bloody good enough. And look at it. You have a swimming pool for yourself. Oh man. Some of them maybe is two bedroom and some of them one bedroom. That's lovely. A lie. A lie. It is nice. It's a 
Mexican restaurant, Mexican food, Mexico. Are you from Mexico? Mexican restaurant, Mexico. Roy, my friend, your suggestion is fantastic. I love it, but Mexico? Roy, when I was living in Canada, trust me, every, even a long weekend, because usually you get very good price between Canada and Mexico for the tours for three days, four days, five days. I've been to Mexico maybe, I don't know, if I don't lie, maybe more than 30, 40 times. I don't want to go to Mexico. I can see everywhere in Mexico, but one thing that it just bothers me in Mexico, especially for past few years, it wasn't like this. It getting so pricey. Even some of the bar, they try to copy United States. They try to copy them. For example, some of the bar, when it's busy and something, you know what they ask for? Hundred dollars US entrance fee. Are you kidding me? Hundred dollars. 